Good morning, Norton Lake High School. Parents, thank you for being here today to celebrate your child. It is quite an accomplishment, and we thank you for your support and care for them along the way. Before we get right into them signing with their college or their military branch, I'd like to turn the floor over to a representative from the Get to College Center in South Haven, Mr. T.J. Walker. Good morning. I got a fancy microphone. Good morning. Parents, y'all doing okay? All right. Students, seniors, y'all good? Okay. All right, so this, this is a very exciting time for y'all, right? Can we turn the music off? Is it possible to kill the, to, oh. Okay, um, I wanna give you guys a, a few pieces of advice before you leave off to go to college. The first thing is confirm your money. So be sure that you understand all the funds that you have. Be sure that you're checking all your emails from the colleges. Many students are um, facing verification at this point, and there are a lot of students who will miss the verification emails, which means they will miss getting the money physically in their accounts. So you want to be sure you do that. Um, sign up for orientation. Be sure that you finalize all your housing plans. Um, don't fall into what's called summer melt. Do y'all know what summer melt is? Have any idea what summer melt could be? That's where students are all fired up about going off to college. They come to these events like this and they're very excited, but then between June and July, they're not attached to college or attached to education in any way. And so they start working at Sonic or they start doing whatever, and when it comes time to move off in August, they're like, man, forget it. I'm just gonna keep working. So we wanna encourage y'all to keep this fire that you have going today. Keep that going throughout the summer so you'll still be motivated to go off um, in August. Number one piece of advice I can give you guys in August when you do start, number one piece, go to class. I'll say that two more times. Go to class, go to class. That's the number one predictive success in college. Um, so that's your to-do list for this summer. Parents, I have a not to-do list for y'all. Um, I have three titles I want y'all to not wear, or two, three hats I don't want y'all to wear. Number one, don't be a helicopter parent. And what does that mean? What does a helicopter typically do? It hovers over something, right? Your student... <laughs> there appears to be some support for that, sorry. Um, so don't be a helicopter parent, meaning, yes, we want you to support them, um, but allow them to, you know, take control of this situation because Who's gonna be sitting in the classroom in August? These people right over here, all right? Don't be a lawnmower parent. Meaning you just literally run them over and take over the whole thing. So when you do go off to orientation and they allow the student to go with their orientation leader to sign up for classes, you don't have to go with them, okay? So please don't try to run over the whole process. Number three, don't be a babysitter. Um, you've been spoon feeding them for the most part for their entire life. Um, now is the time for them to take that bottle, put that spoon in their hand, and take control of this whole situation themselves. So think of yourself as a driver's ed teacher. Um, in the driver's ed class, that teacher is in the, in the passenger seat. They have control of the pedals. They can control the steering wheel if necessary. So we want you guys to support your students. We want you to celebrate them in their successes, support them in the failures, because they could happen, um, but allow them to take control because um, this is their time. All right, so that's my advice to parents, students, that's my advice to you. Congratulations. If you need any more support this summer when you're making those final decisions from get to college, come see us over in South Haven. Thank y'all. All right, class of 2018, are you ready to get this thing started? All right, first up for the class of 2018, for the U.S. Navy is Ariel Flowers. <laughs> Next up, going to Alcorn State University is Ronisha Woody. 
Also going to Alcorn State University, Miss Nakedrian Allen. Next, going to the American Musical and Dramatic Academy, Miss Serenity Holloway. Headed to Arkansas State University, Markel Richardson. Going to the Baptist College of Health Sciences, Tysha Jones. Headed to Blue Mountain College, Miss Shelby Adams. Next, we have Christian Brothers University, Carlos Alvarado. Also going to Christian Brothers, Alan Barshinger. Christian Brothers University, now Angela Milliner. And also going to Christian Brothers University, Rosa Santana Potts. Headed to Clark Atlanta University, Miss Kiana Hunt. Going to Hines Community College, Kaylin Calhoun. Going to Itawamba Community College, Miss Christiana Bowen. We have two going to Lemoyne Owen College, Jalen Crockett. And Alexis Liddell. Going to Mississippi College, first is Priscilla Ramirez. Also going to Mississippi College, Mr. Jonathan Trim. Headed to Rust College, Journey Gibbs. Going to Southwest Tennessee Community College, Deanna Jones. Headed to the University of Tennessee at Martin, Trinity Shannon. Going to the University of Georgia, Manuel DaCosta. Headed to Virginia State University and the Army National Guard, Shakira Brown. And headed to Bradley University, Mr. Dylan Waldrop. I'd like to take just a moment and say thank you to those of you going to serve in our military. For the U.S. Marine Corps, Jordan Gillespie. Brandon Martinez. Dallas Wilburn. And Mr. Kobe Young. Headed to the U.S. Army, Deja Hambrick. And Joshua Tapp. Headed to the Army National Guard, we have Shakira Brown. We have Mr. Evan Lampkin. And Ja'Kayla Poole. Next up, going to the University of Southern Mississippi, Kentavious Boyd, Jacob Innes, Chastity Jefferson, and Divine Cuthrell. Headed to the Jackson State University, we have Zaisha Glenn and Shakina Thomas. Headed to Mississippi State University, 
we have Shamar Barbie. Peyton Burns. Miss Addison Glover. Miss Jennifer Hinton. Miss Kamaya Ingram. Janiah Jefferson. Dejon Johnson. Mr. Justin Payton. We have Justin Person. Trayvon Randolph. Morgan Stevens. And also headed to Mississippi State University, Alexis Wiggins. Hill State. Next up, Delta State University. He fighting okra. Next up, Miss Amber Browning. Nikki Carter. And Caitlin KP Pignataro. Headed to the University of Mississippi, Hotty Toddy. First up, Saini Cisse. Kayla Heron. Caleb Pinland. Miss Tria Phillips. Amy Stepp. Brianna Stuckey. And also headed to Ole Miss, Chandler Wooten. Going to the University of Memphis, we have Gabriella Hamilton, Takedra Harris, Satavius Kennedy, Gregory Robinson. Alyssa Storley, Miss Casey Tansy, Mr. Alec Watson, and headed to Northwest Community College, we have Paris Ash, Mr. Kenyatta Bennett. Yasmeen Berkeley. Bing Baronio. Mr. Key Boykins. Isaiah Davis. Asia Dooley. Jamel Farmer. The Dacia Flax. Charia Fowler. Brietta Goodman. Lando Harris. LaKayla Harris. Brianna Hobson. Next, going to Northwest, Janisha Hurt. Next up, Myron Johnson. Also headed to Northwest Community College, Amia Kimball. Miss Kira Lloyd. 
Nathaniel Lumpkin, Jessica McMullen, Mr. Darian Middleton, Tajaya Odin, Juana Perez, Demetria Presley, Miss Taronique Sowell. Next up, MJ Spearman. Miss Gymnasia Tatum. Also headed to Northwest, Asia Thornton. Tierra Triplett. Aya Turner. Jeanette Valdez. Amani Washington. Javeria Williams. Corey Gault. Rebecca York. Tiana Thompson. And Miss. Hannah Shaheen. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear it one more time for the class of 2018. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the tables are still set up. If you want pictures with your table, also, Mr. Lewis has put this on the internet. If you go to the Horn Lake High School website, click on EVTV. This entire event is streamed online. Thank you for being here, and parents, thank you. Congratulations, class of 2018.